On a cold and dark November night in 1859, Joseph headed home between the hours of eight and nine to an oral farm where he did dwell at the lock and crook he tripped and fell into the deadly waters when he missed the towpass line. The landlord of the Royal Oak, whose name was Henry Ball, said that in the morning he received an urgent call. Asking him to help to pull the body from the Leeds Canal And he saw it was Joseph Glover, a man that he knew well The jury at the inquest heard two others had met their end In the canal's waters had the same deceptive bend The foreman asked the funds be found for safety railings in the ground and the coroner said a letter to the company he said If you're by the Liverpool Lees just by the old crook block please stop for a moment and be sure to take a look and give a thought to the grieving wives and the children of those who lost their lives and be careful of your footing on the last route Joseph took He's buried out of Holland So if you're out that way Please remember Joseph Glover And how he lost his life that day